One Sussex County Sheriff looking to continue his fight for the power to arrest. Sheriff Jeff Christopher is up for re-election. Good evening, I'm Paul Butler. And I'm Steve Hammond. Welcome to WBOC News at 6. In Delaware, Sheriff's deputies do not have the right to arrest people. And for more than a year, the Sussex County Sheriff's Office has been trying to change that. Well, now the man who led the charge is up for re-election and wants to continue the fight. Bureau Chief Evan Kozlov joins us in our Sussex County Bureau this evening. And Evan, Sheriff Jeff Christopher calls arresting rights a priority. I spent some time with Christopher today and he told me that nothing, not even a Supreme Court decision, will stop him from fighting this if he gets a second term. Sheriff Jeff Christopher pulls into his designated parking spot in Georgetown. Now he tells WBOC he hopes to keep that spot as he runs for re-election. But his first term has been bumpy at times, defined by the debate over arresting powers. Right now, the sheriff's office cannot arrest people, something he was looking to change through his first term. He even brought the case to the state Supreme Court where his appeal was rejected. I have here an interview uh, before it went to the Supreme Court. You said, if I can't win and get justice in the state of Delaware, then I'll pick up my family and I'll move out of this godforsaken place. What's that's, your response now? That's correct. Uh, I still stand by my words. I asked him to elaborate. The fight's not over. I mean, there's a lot of assumption that I'm giving up because the, the state Supreme Court says, well, if the people want to appeal that and go to another level or start it over with a different uh, approach, then the fight's not over. But some in Sussex County say it's about time he does give it up. According to Mitch Crane, the chairman of the Sussex County Democratic Party Committee, Christopher's lawsuit has cost the county about $100,000 already. And will not get what he wants. Eric Hunter of Seaford says it's time they stop spending all this money on what he says is a losing battle. He should let it go and let the state tell him what to do. That's what they're paying him for. And the court has been decisive as well. The Supreme Court voted unanimously against Christopher, saying the right to arrest is not a core duty of the sheriff's office. But with Christopher's promise to make this fight continue in a second term, the door is certainly not closed on this debate in Sussex County. At this point, the Democrats have not picked somebody to go against him, but Crane says that it's very likely that somebody will emerge in the next couple months. Reporting live from the Sussex County Bureau, Evan Kozloff, WBOC News, back to you in the Newsplex.